Hi, and welcome to the Yarn Habit Geek Podcast. My name is Laura. You can find me on Facebook, Instagram, and Ravelry as Yarn Habit Geek. There is also a Ravelry group for the podcast where you can find all the show notes and take part in the Doctor Who Cal, which ends at the end of July. And um, let's get started with this week's episode, shall we? All right, it's Whips of the Week, and first up, it's the Cozy Memories Blanket. I've uh, added in the uh, yellow number two pencil yarn from my yarn enabler. And I'm already working on the next one, which was the second part of the sock set for the pencil set. The number two pencil sock from Yarn Enabler. I'm since I'm using the last of uh, the yarn I have left. So if I run out of this yarn, I'm gonna pop in some of the yellow, so that way it looks all pencily. But uh, yeah, so basically it was just one square, and um, I'll soon be coming up to. I haven't used any more sock yarn yet, but I've sewn in some ends for that. Enough about that. Now the rest, a good majority of what I have left in Whips of the Week, I only worked on a bit because I actually rescheduled my knitting and crochet schedule was to add in a day where I can relax so that way I don't uh, wreck my wrist again. So, next up, not much done, but it's for for me to, it's, um, blah, 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 sorry. It's the, uh, Fifth Doctor's, uh, Cricket Jumper that I'm working alongside for the, do my, uh, Doctor Who cow. Well, because I want to at least work on something Doctor Who, I will not be taking part in the prizes. But, but uh, I basically got two rows in before I am um, before today, because uh, let's just say I was also a little busy during the week, and I'll be talking about that in the next segment after whips of the week. Next up, I actually got to work more on this, which is Anna. From Frozen, uh, I finally um, I weaved in some ends. I added the wig cap. I'm currently working on her boots, and I soon will be going to just put in the designs on the skirt. And I am also working on her little cape. So basically, I am making the pattern for this. I'm writing it all down in my little. In my uh, sketchbook that I have the uh, pre-sketches so that way I know what I'm doing for an amigurumi. And let's see. Next up, not much. I just did maybe a round or two, but it is the Red Hood sweater. I'm now on the third round of the upper target line so hopefully I will have a full round of the target done for next week that's what I'm hoping I'm hoping I can get that done by next week because I really need to focus on this sweater because I want to have it done for Fanex this year and next up obviously I didn't work much on it I'm still because I started a few row, well, technically working on stitches, but it's the um, Fall Fantasy 7 Advent Children Cloud Top. So I didn't get much done. So I probably won't mention, won't show this up on, uh, probably I won't show a lot of the uh, stuff I only worked a tiny bit on unless there's like 
a major change in how much I've worked on it. And for any of the other minor things. And lastly, uh, I started working on a new Infinity Gauntlet. I got a finger finish. But uh, I still got to do the um, detail ridgings. Now, I'm using um, my uh, Hair and Simply Soft Holiday Yarn in the color gold for this. And I'm working this a little bigger than the size of my hand. So that way any hands bigger than mine can actually fit into it. So hopefully I will have this one done by next week. And that is it for whips of the week hopefully i will have uh, different whips done for next week and uh, now let's get on to the next segment all right time for some con talk which is not yarn or knitting or crochet related but uh this past weekend there were two big con, well, one's a big party con, one's a smaller, but still good con that I went to. The big party con was uh, Yeti Con, which is held in the Blue Mountain Resort area, uh, which um, I unfortunately don't go to because it is way out of my travel distance, even though it is located here in Ontario. So unfortunately, I don't drive, so that that con will probably always be out of my reach. But the other con that was happening during the weekend was the Sailor Moon Pretty Heroes Convention, which was held at the Ontario Science Center, for which basically I went there because I have a one guest role. My one guest, meaning if they bring in the one guest, if a con brings in one guest I really, really want to see, or haven't seen it in a long time, I'm going immediately to that con. And Pretty Heroes was the con that got that one guest. Because, um, yeah, Yeti Con doesn't do much guest-wise besides cosplayers. I'm more into the voice acting guests. And this year... They brought in Matt Hill, who was the voice of Bankotsu in Inuyasha, Kira in Gundam Seed, he was Raphael in uh, Ninja Turtles The Next Mutation, and also I believe in, he didn't do the voice for the third Ninja Turtles movie, but he was in the suit. So, um... Yeah, basically, I went to the con, I went to the Prairie Hills con, see Matt Hill, who I hadn't seen since 2006, so that has been like 12 years since I last saw him. And, uh, and because uh, this Pretty Heroes was now a two-day con at the Science Center, we got to have one day and we got to have a day in the Science Center. I went on Sunday because, weirdly, I somehow entered handler con mom mode during the first day of the con, and that can't be helped. I've been doing conventions for 16 years now. Oh, and um, that is just pretty awesome that I've been doing this for, doing cons for 16 years. And uh, my next big con that I'm going to is uh, TFCon, which is in Mississauga, and they they not got, and let's face it, they got not just one, but two guests I have been wanting to see, and they are from Beast Wars. So I'll be uh, bringing my Beast Wars set with me to get signed, so... And that is pretty much it. It for Con Talk and this episode of the podcast. 
I will see you all next week, hopefully with more done, possibly a new prize for the for the knit along. And that is it. I will see you once again. I will see you all next week. Till then, stay crafty, my friends. <laughs>